Welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I'm Greg and this is a numbers matching 396 real black car, rotisserie restored, and you are gonna love checking this beauty out. This is one drop dead gorgeous car, man. I always look at the stripes on these cars. When you see the workmanship and all the curves and all the nice sharp corners and everything and the stripes, you know they did a beautiful job on the restoration. All the lines are lining up good here on the hood. The hood's nice and flush to the uh, front fender. It's nice and flush here also. Now I point out a lot of the same things all the time because these are the things you need to be looking at when you're buying one of these cars. You see all those lines there on the door, nice and straight. This door's lined up nice with the quarter. That door handle looks like it's fairly new. The door operates nice and smooth. You can see the door lips here are nice and clean and nicely painted. The rubber's been replaced. Looks like the latch is new also. The door panel also looks new. Armrest looks new. Look inside the door jam there, how nice and clean it is up in there. Those are all telltale signs of the condition of the car. You can see the uh, center console. This is a real four-speed car also. So it's a real black car, real 396 car, numbers matching. Highly restored, just drop dead gorgeous. Dash pad itself's in good shape. The lenses on the gauges look good. It's got an aftermarket radio in it there. The faces of the gauges look good. The carpeting looks new. The uh, sill here looks fantastic. Look down that black quarter panel there. Look at those reflections. It is beautiful. Got good looking chrome on the back bumper. Again, you see how all these curves are nice, all these corners are nice and sharp. Inside the trunk, we got jack, lug wrench, they've got nice carpeting in here. Somebody's done a nice job finishing out the trunk. Got nice paint. Always look at the lips on the bottom of the deck lid also. The gutters here around the opening. All things you need to look at on every car you look at buying. Look down the side of that beautiful black car. She is gorgeous. Looks like the passenger door is open. Let's shut that for you. How nice that shuts. That line looks nice. Look at the reflections. Just beautiful paintwork on the car. My hat is off to the guy that did the bodywork on this beauty. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we've got about 235 cars in stock and we own every one of those cars. We don't do any consignment whatsoever. And we're buying about 40 cars a month. And I'm in charge of picking out every one of those cars. Now I've got about 35 years in the business and I'm gonna put those 35 years to work for you, helping you pick out your dream car. We're in this numbers matching rotisserie restored beautiful 70 Chevelle now uh, it is nasty outside so we are not going to be driving it today but rest assured as soon as it's nice out we'll be out driving this beauty um, it's got vintage air conditioning everything on the dash is looking sweet it's got an aftermarket radio uh, of course it's got four speed it is numbers matching the car is amazing real black car you're gonna love it when we park this dream in your drive and we can park it in your drive no matter where you live in the world. Call Tom anytime at 248-974-9513 and he'll tell you just how easy that process is. If you need help with financing, you can help out with that too. If you want to come in and visit, please do. We invite you to come in. We're close to the airport. Now we're about to do something nobody else in the industry does. We're going to put this car up on the lift so you can check out the underside, see just how nice the bottom side is also. All right, we're underneath this beautiful 1970 Chevelle now, and you can see it is drop-dead gorgeous under here too. Look at the paint job on that gas tank, man. It is looking sweet. Looks like bare metal, but that's actually paint. 
Uh, the exhaust is new, the drop downs look good, the bushings look good, bottom of the trunk floor looks great. We got a uh, 12 bolt rear end in here with brand new brake lines on it. Now we've rolled it over and counted it and it's counting at about a 270 and when you roll it over, definitely looks like it's a posi. Uh, we've got um, new bushings in the lower control arms. We got the extra braces that the SS has all had on them. Looks like Flowmaster mufflers. Uh, U joints look like they're in good shape. It's got the nice hangers on it. Uh, the floorboards are looking sweet. The snubber's still there. Upper control arms also look like they've got good bushings. I always check out the low areas in the frame here on all these cars. This frame looks fantastic. Uh, backsides the rockers also and all these body mounts you want to take a look at them backsides of these rockers are smooth as can be pinch weld looks good floorboards look great they've got nice paint on them uh, beautiful job on this car um, everything about it's nice and clean under here we do have a new fuel line um, going front to back and then we do also have a new brake line over here Looks like the parking brake cable is also new. It's got the stock appearing clutch on it. It's got the Z-bar, so it is the manual clutch. Uh, the trans is not numbers matching. Uh, it is a four-speed Muncie. Uh, the bushings in the front uh, control arms here look like they're new. Backing plates look new. Uh, flex lines look good. Ball joints look like they were replaced. Uh, we do have disc brakes up front, and the guys do take the brakes all apart, make sure they're in good working order. Uh, they'll also check out all the steering gear. Looks like that drag link is new. Looks like the, um, the uh, front suspension here has all been gone through. I see new bushings. I see new bolts. I see new uh, cotter pins. I see the front frame horns are nice and straight. The um, core support itself is in good shape. Looks like uh, the lines here on the AC condenser are also new. The lines going to the receiver dryer look new. Uh, chrome on the front bumper looks amazing. There's everything about the car nice and clean. Uh, inner wheelhouses are nice and clean. Of course, it's got the uh, wide oval tires. Um, those are the tires of the day. I remember my old 67 Cougar had one of these in the trunk as a spare. Um, these are uh, 7015s. The paint on the rim looks great. Trim ring looks great. Center cap also looks great. The paint work going right down to the bottom edge of the front fender looks good. I always feel around on the back side here. These are all telltale signs on every car. Um, that lip there holds a lot of junk, so that's one of the first things to go. That one's nice and clean, and you can also see that pinch weld. See how nice and clean it is? See how you can still see all the spot welds and everything? That tells you it is in beautiful shape, just like the day it was built. Look at those wheel wells. Those wheel wells have got bright black paint on them, just like the exterior of the car. Looking sweet. Of course, out back here, also the paintwork on the wheel looks good, center cap, trim ring, and again, brand new um, wide ovals. And let's see, I'm double check on the size here. Yep, yep there's 7015s also. Well, let's get under the hood and check out what's going on under there. While I was looking for the size, I noted something. These are the radials, guys. These are the remakes of the wide ovals. I mean, they even fooled me. They look like the bias ply tires that have been remade in the radials. I tell you what, Coker's doing a great job on these babies. Let's get under the hood. All right, under the hood here, we've got the numbers matching 396. It's got a period correct uh, quadrajet carb on there. It looks like it's got the period correct intake on it, um, alternator. It does have an upgraded AC compressor. It does have uh, power brakes. The firewall is nicely painted. It does have power steering. Uh, the core support is in beautiful shape. Radiator looks like a rebuilt unit. It is a cross flow. Uh, we do have uh, one of the tops on the battery here. It's a maintenance free battery and at the top makes it look like it's one of the antique batteries. Uh, the exhaust manifolds uh, have been painted with the bare metal high heat paint, making them look good. Bottom side of the hood's nicely painted. This is one amazing machine, guys. She's a 70 Chevelle. It's a real black car. It's numbers matching. It's a four speed. It don't get any better than this. 
call Tom at 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Sales park this dream in your driveway.